Hello students, let us continue with uh, today's TSP class. Uh, I'll be discussing inverse DFT today. Hmm? IDFT. It is inverse DFT. Inverse discrete Fourier transforms. Okay. What exactly is inverse DFT? In inverse DFT, you will be knowing the frequency domain signals X of K. This is the frequency domain signal with given with frequency domain signal you will be applying inverse dft formula idft formula so that you can find out time domain signal x of n okay frequency domain signal x of k is given you will be applying idft formula so that you can find out time domain signal x of n uh, hence the idft formula is exactly inverse of that where DFT formula is hmm? that is x of n x of n is equal to 1 over n summation k is equal to 0 to n minus 1 x of k e raised to j 2 pi by n k n in previous formula you have seen DFT formula you have seen that instead of x of n there was x of k here instead of x of k there was x of n hmm? here e raised to minus j 2 pi by n k was there now it is e raised to j 2 pi by n k n the same formula if you want to convert it into matrix form you can write like this x n is equal to 1 over n this twiddle factor matrix whatever is there no that you can write it as w n hmm? and because instead of j there is minus j here it is j it is wn conjugate hmm? into x of k if i expand this no if i expand this it looks like this if i expand this uh, matrix formula hmm? this is the matrix formula it looks like this x0 x1 like this x say x3 hmm? for x2 x3 is equal to here w matrix will come please see that wn it is conjugate conjugate means what wherever j is there minus j will be there wherever minus j is there plus j will be there that's all hmm? into here x0 x1 x2 and x3 frequency domain signals hmm? This is what is the IDFT formula. You can apply the fundamental formula or the matrix formula, whichever is easy. Let us solve one example. Let us solve one example. Uh, with that, it will be clear uh, whatever formula I have given. Let us solve an example where you already know this example one. Given x of k which is equal to 10 minus 2 plus j2 minus 2 comma minus 2 minus j2 okay find find x of n you have to find x of n now you have to you are given with frequency domain signal x of k you have to find out x of n which is time domain signal let me apply the fundamental uh, let me apply the matrix formula hmm? let me apply the matrix formula now what i will do uh, let me take n is equal to 4 hmm? this is a 4 point dft let me take n as 4 because 1 2 3 4 points are there how to do this let me write time domain signal x0 x1 x2 x3 is equal to here conjugate matrix you have to write the you see by the time you should know how exactly to write the four point twiddle factor matrix hmm? see now 1 1 1 and 1 1 1 1 and 1 third row 1 minus 1 1 minus 1 third column 1 minus 1 1 minus 1 previously how you entered you started with minus j here isn't it correct in the case of finding out dft you have started with minus j here at this point now you conjugate that means plus j hmm? when you enter plus j here conjugate of that minus j here hmm? 
when you entered j here minus j here when you entered minus j here j here okay like this otherwise j j minus j minus j you are twiddle factor conjugate you please see that this is wn conjugate hmm? not wn matrix now multiplied by x that is x not x1 x2 x3 given you are already given with 10 minus 2 plus j2 minus 2 minus 2 minus j2 now i have to i have to find uh, x0 x1 etc okay x0 x1 x2 x3 etc now first x0 is equal to first row first column that means 1 into 10 plus 1 into minus 2 plus j2 that means i am simply adding 10 10 minus 2 plus j2 minus 2 minus 2 minus j2 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 cancels 2 2 2 2 that means 10 minus 6 that is equal to 4 uh, here one missing point is there i am very sorry this is 1 by n i am doing the corrections here see this this is 1 by n hmm? that means generally this is the missing point where all students should be very careful 1 by 4 hmm? 1 by n is there in this formula 1 by n is missed please see that it is 1 by 4 that means 4 divided by 4 my answer has come out to be 1 now hmm? now x1 similarly x1 is equal to 1 by n that is 1 by 4 1 by 4 second row this column 10 j minus j2 plus 2 uh, minus j2 j square 2 that means minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 minus 2 plus 2 okay minus j this is j2 j2 into minus j square that is minus 2 hmm? now minus j2 this cancels minus 2 plus 2 cancels 10 minus 2 that is 8 8 divided by 4 8 divided by 4 that is 2 similarly x1 uh, x2 hmm? x2 x2 means this row multiplied by the column that is 1 by 4 don't miss this 1 by n 1 by 4 10 then minus that is plus 2 plus 2 minus j2 then minus 2 minus 2 then plus j2 plus j2 and then plus that is j square 2 minus 2 hmm? that means minus j2 plus j2 goes hmm? 12 okay uh, minus 2 minus 2 then cancels 8 no somewhere it is wrong now 1 into 10 10 minus 1 into this that becomes plus 2 plus 2 minus j2 then 1 into minus 2 then the last one that is minus 1 minus 1 this minus 1 into minus 2 that is plus 2 hmm? plus 2 and then plus 2 minus j2 that is plus j2 that is done huh? 1 2 is missing then it becomes uh, 2 minus 2 cancels out hmm? 10 plus 2 12 12 divided by 3 that is 3 last one x3 is equal to this row multiplied by this 1 by 4 again hmm? 1 by 4 again 1 into 10 10 10 plus j2 plus j2 then minus j square 2 that is plus 2 then minus into minus plus 2 then j into this minus j2 then minus j square 2 that means plus 2 cancels of j2 and minus j2 10 12 14 16 that is 16 divided by 4 that is 4 my answer has come now actually my answer is 1 2 3 4 isn't it x of n is equal to 1 2 3 and 4 you already know this answer because in the first example when you solved the matrix method now you started with x of n 1 2 3 4 and you have you got this answer 10 minus 2 plus j2 as x of k hence hmm? this is my answer 
This is how you can apply the matrix method so as to find inverse DFT. What is very important here? First thing is please write 1 by n and then make this matrix as a conjugate one. Okay, rest all will follow. Hmm? While multiplying also you be careful. This is how you can find out the inverse DFT. Hmm? Uh, I will just post an assignment hmm? uh, for this inverse DFT. Yesterday's assignment many has to submit. You have to submit all those assignments hmm? so as to carry forward with my uh, video sessions. Okay, thank you.